to open this wand. I must find a wand opener. That's right there on the damn hook. See the can opener? I'm not very good with this kind. I have a... Oh, it's the best kind. Right here, I'll do it. But as far as what I mean, is like, I mean, I had a dream that I was laying on my back, working on a truck, mm -hmm. looking up at a little metal roof on red framed metal. Now, it might not see, it might seem like anything, but it was before I worked at Paperscape, before I'd been over around that building. And I swear that here I was laying on the ground, but I can remember having dreamed about looking up at what I'm looking at. And it was, and, I, and then in my mind it's like, no, oh, I didn't know what this was. And that's a thin ass cheap, that's a, that's a knockoff of a cheap wine opener. That's a two times cheap wine opener. I have a plastic. Oh my oh, God. Hold on, let me see if I got that other one. No, look, you can just take this piece off of here and you just redo it. <laughs> uh oh. It must still be in Uh oh. Matilda. We're losing the cork. Oh no. The cork's going down. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. You saw it come up, right? Mm -hmm. It moved up some. Give me something with a sharp point. So that I can hold like a, a little tiny thin knife, so that I can hold the cork, so that when I put pressure in against it to put the cork screw into it, that'll work. Oh no, it's going down. I know it's going down. That's what I said was going to happen. Damn it. Here, well, we'll just get all the cork out and then. Shake the loose cork out, then I can just knock it in. You know what I mean? There's a loose cork in it. You're screwed. That's why you get the shit with the twist off for 539. <laughs> <laughs> 